an object is thrown vertically, its height in feet is given by this specific function. How high does the object rise? And when we see that, we should think max. So we're looking for a maximum. How do we find the maximum of a function? We're going to find the derivative of that function and set it equal to zero. So if we take the derivative of this, we get negative 32t plus 48. And if we set that equal to zero, we get negative 32t equals negative 48. So we get that t equals uh, 3 halves. Now, 3 halves is not one of our answers. Also, remember, t normally stands for time. And we ask how high. So we need to substitute this t value back into our original function to figure out uh, what the function is at that point. So we've got negative 16 times 9 over 4 plus 48 times 3 over 2 plus 5. Uh, well, six, 4 going to 16 4 times. So we have negative 36 with the first thing. 2 will go into 48 24 times. And 24 times 3 is 72 plus 5. And if we do this out, we get 41 for our final answer. So it reaches a maximum height of 41 at a time of 3 and a half seconds.